joined by Hofstra coach Larissa Anderson following the Pride's sweep at the hands of the College of Charleston today. Coach, just overall thoughts on, on the performances today? Uh, not very happy to say the least. Um, they played a great game. They did. They, they kept us off balance. Um, first game we left way too many runners on base. We left 10 on base. Uh, didn't have quality at bats with runners in scoring position. Um, and, and Peslak gave up too many free bases. She had six walks or seven walks, uh, one hit by a pitch. Um, so she put too many people on base. And uh, we just didn't capitalize when we had runners in scoring position in those opportunities. Um, I think the biggest stat was how many easy outs we gave them. Where we, had, uh, we only had probably about five ground balls throughout the entire course of the day. Uh, we got to have better at bats. We got to hit the ball hard and put more more pressure on the opposing team. Now, in in game two, more more you know similar as to game one, just couldn't really solve uh, Sydney Shipley on the mound. What did you see from her? Oh, she threw an unbelievable game. Um, mixed both sides of the plate, kept us off balance with an off speed, uh, had us no hit going into the sixth or seventh inning, and then uh, um, she threw unbelievable. And we just didn't make the adjustments we needed to make. We hit. Loud foul balls were just another strike, and, and we got to do a better job and make adjustments and give our team an opportunity to, to score more runs. All right, Coach, game three tomorrow, obviously weather permitting, senior day. Uh, I just want to take a moment to you know reflect on, on the last game for the seniors tomorrow. Uh, it's a tough day. It really is. You know, your, your seniors give you so much, uh, four years. They work so hard. They have so much pride and dedication to this program. Um, hopefully the weather holds up and we're able to, to play for them. And, and, you know, Senior Day is one of those things where you're playing for your seniors. You, you want them to go out on a good note. You honor them and, and you really contribute everything that you have to the, the dedication that they have. So I love them to death. They've, been, they've worked so hard while they've been here at Hofstra. And I know that they're going to be tremendous um, in, the, in the real world once they leave here. All right, Coach, thanks. My pleasure.